you. Well, all right. Um, so uh, we've got one from Trevor Moore. Hmm. Okay. Uh, who tragically passed away in an accident uh, a couple weeks ago. Rest in peace. At the Rest young age of 41. Wow. 41. Wow. wow. Truly gone too soon. Very soon. Yeah. It's amazing. He was an actor, writer, uh, comedian. Okay. <laughs> um, okay. But yeah, too soon, 41. But yeah. Definitely. That's, that's what we got. Uh, this is uh, High in Church, The Ballad of Billy John. <laughs> high in Church, The Ballad of Billy John. <laughs> okay. okay, okay, being high in church. High yeah. in church? Yeah, man. Is that I a sin? No, 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 not at all. I think as long as you attend service, you can be in whatever state, as long as you're not obstructing anybody around you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Okay. You're there for one thing. But you all should be there for one thing. Yeah. You know what I mean? All right, let's get but, into um, it. Yeah, being drunk, you know what I'm saying? I mean, a lot of people have probably been drunk in church. You know I imagine High as well But you know Depends Depends on you but Let's go man You ready? Alright here we go Yeah This uh, This next song Is a Is a folk song That I just recently wrote It's called uh, The Ballad of Singer. Billy John <laughs> when Billy John Was a simple man Worked in the fields Most his life Provided for his wife and kids And left his dreams on the side One day when the kids left home Well, he picked up his guitar It had been a while But his fingers still knew How to reach the heart <laughs> He played a song about life and love His hopes and regrets Then with a little prodding from the missus He put it on the internet Okay. <laughs> when the view started pouring in, tears of joy started to fall. And then they scrolled to the comment section, and this is what they saw. <laughs> Eat a bag of shit, kind of face. <laughs> Don't blow your fucking head. This shit just raped my ears. Never heard nothing so bad. I hope you fucking die. And I hope you get a you should just kill yourself, you're a fag LOL game. <laughs> Billy John's wife watched her husband as he shrugged and tried to smile. <laughs> he put his guitar away, and stopped and stared at it for a while. But she knew he felt like a fool and he'd never play again. So she turned on her webcam and let her message begin. She said, the man you've heard tonight, I've watched for 35 years. <laughs> He's got a kind and gentle soul, and thanks to you, that soul's in tears. And the people said, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Show us your tits. Uh, One out of ten, I wouldn't bang. I bet she's trying to eat your dick. She'll get sterilized so that she can't have kids. Then they photoshop a bunch of pictures of her covered in jizz. Ah, uh, yep. <laughs> well, the video went viral. 57 million hits. <laughs> Billy John's wife became a meme on the internet. <laughs> They played the clip on CNN and read tweets about her weight. Cause I guess that's the sort of thing that the news does nowadays. Now Billy John and his wife did nothing wrong and they weren't dumb. They just hadn't paid attention to what we'd all become. <laughs> and a couple weeks later, after avoiding it for some time, a broken down and changed Billy John finally went back online. He found a page of a blogger <laughs> still making fun of his wife. He signed up and made an account, and this is what he typed. <laughs> he 
eat a bag of shit cunt face. <laughs> Don't blow your fucking dad. Your shit just raped my eyes. Never read nothing so bad. <laughs> I hope you fucking die, and I hope you get AIDS. <laughs> and the world lost a Billy John, and it gained more of the same. Is what we've all become. <laughs> Somebody just trying to do something nice and think they're doing something. <laughs> you know, little hobby they got, trying to post a little <laughs> song on the internet. <laughs> I mean, you're, you're posting it for. Yeah. For, I mean, this is, this is, it comes with it. It comes with posting. You know what I'm saying? It comes with the territory. It's, it's dangerous. The territory. You know what I'm saying? But you know, you do what you want. You know what I'm saying? I post what I want. You say what you want. I think it's a fair trade. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know sure. what I mean? <laughs> I think, you know, you know, there's been things that I've posted that um have got some comments that have <laughs> kinda hurt the heart. <laughs> uh, uh, y'all be killing me though, I'll be laughing, man. Comments be funny as hell. Yeah, it's all it's all in love though. All yeah, the comments man. are yeah, man. Never most most sense of sense. them. Most of them are, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, yeah. meant to be nice. Yeah. You can have your own opinion. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. That is what we've all become. We've all become like a toxic a social media society. Yeah. Okay. That's what we all live on in social media. Yeah, man. And anything yeah. anybody posts, we attack it like some piranhas. Like as soon as it's posted, we go to it, we either like it or dislike it or leave a comment or yeah. we share it. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. It's toxic. Yeah. I mean, it's, 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 yeah, yeah. I mean, in, I, in a way, it's just what it, we it, are. It's just what we are. It, it, it's a perception, you know what I'm saying? Just like it, you know, what I'm saying, just, just like just like we attack it. Like you know, what I'm saying we attack it because they post it, but they want to make it public for people to see. You well, know I'm, saying, what I'm saying everybody posts any anything we post. Everybody yeah. has their own. Every everybody posts something. Exactly. And every everything anybody posts gets attacked in some way. Sure. Yeah. Sure. 